was the right time um, in a good place, at peace with the decision and yeah, gonna just concentrate on club football and spending time with my loved ones now. Incredible. I want to say in the last few years it's been a bit euphoric. I said this after the Euros, but I think what we've achieved over the last few years in terms of putting women's football back on the map in England is something that I'll never ever forget and take for granted. It's the greatest honour I think anyone could ever have in sport, representing your country, it's, it's the highest level. Um, and to do that for so many years with some of the most amazing people has been an absolute blessing and a privilege. For me, it's been some of the best memories of my life and made the best friendships um, to take with me into my future. So I'm so grateful for every opportunity I've ever had. And like I said, just putting on the England shirt every time, it, 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 there's no better feeling. I think it'd be silly to not say winning the Euros. Um, you know, like I said, it put women's football back on the map and it gave the country something to scream and shout about. I think that's definitely the biggest memory I'll ever have. You know, making a World Cup final was right up there. Obviously not the, the ending we wanted, but, you know, I think inspiring the nation and the next generation of footballers and the talent that we've got is something that I'll hold dear to me. And as a footballer, you, you've got to have a short-term memory because it's always on to what's next. And I think for once, in my life now I'm going to be able to look back and really reflect on those memories and those moments and it's been incredible I've got you know such amazing memories with so many people and, and some of the girls even on this camp I've, I've known for 17 years sorry Lucy throwing out your age there but um, yeah I think it, it, the memories that I've made from from the people that I've been with from the beginning to the people I've only just met in the last few camps every single one of them has, has been a pivotal part of my ride uh, in an England shirt and yeah, Millie, um, I wouldn't have been able to do half the stuff I did without you. So uh, that's a, a massive testament to her as a person. And yeah, she made me absolutely cry my eyes out this morning with a voice note. Um, it's so sweet. So yeah, it's, it's, it's sad that I can't spend my last time um, and my last England camp with her. But yeah, she'll be there forever and be the maid of honour at my wedding and vice versa. So I think, uh, yeah, memories that I've made with some incredible people along the way and ones that I'll never, ever forget. I hope that the next generation go on and make those same memories um, and do it even bigger and better. The pool of talent and the amazing people that are coming through and that are in the setup now is something that I'm really excited to watch. People always say when you know, you know, and for me, uh, now is the right time to step down and let the next generation step in and you know give them a few more years of uh, happiness and enjoyment that I've had. I think I've spent a lot of time in my career away from home. I lived in America for 10 years, so I moved home, you know, after the passing of my dad to, ch to try and be there with my family. And even, even being closer to home, I've not spent enough time with them as I'd like to. So it's going to be a nice time for me to be able to actually spend time with them and my loved ones and, and give them a little bit more of me that they've missed over the last few years. Uh, watch my nephew grow up and things like that are going to be special memories for me. And, a different side of it but yeah I will be the the team's number one fan I cannot wait to see the journey that they're going to go on and what they're going to continue to do it's it's in a great place now but it's going to be phenomenal to see their next chapters and see how individually and collectively they grow as people and players I think everyone you know staff players fans um, they've all been there through the whole journey and some of them longer than others but you know, I wouldn't be here without them and I wouldn't be half the person I am without them. But I think for me, the biggest, the biggest shout out goes to my family there, my rock. Um, been there through thick and thin and supported me through ups and downs and, and everything on the way, on and off the pitch. So just a massive thank you to everybody who's been there and played a part in, in my journey with England because it's, it's been one hell of a ride and yeah, it's one that I'll never forget. So the fans, you've been incredible. Um, you know, I've, I've been here for eight years and at the beginning we were, hitting you know three or four thousand fans and now we're selling out Wembley it's it's absolutely surreal and I keep supporting the girls keep getting behind the girls because without you guys it wouldn't be possible and seeing the way you supported us through the Euros was a massive turning point for the game and it, it, it does, your support does not go unnoticed um, you show up every single game that we play in um, you're there loud and proud banging on your drums with your signs and yeah keep supporting keep cheering the girls and getting behind them because it's going to be an incredible in few years for the, for the Lionesses. I think Rachel has been so incredibly important for this team. Uh, first of all, her energy, 
then her versatility, whatever position I asked her to play, it was either right back, left back, or the number nine, she would do. She's an incredible team player. She's very, very energetic. And she always works hard for the team and has a smile on her face. It's really hard actually to put Rachel's contribution to the Lionesses into words. I think she's been a phenomenal individual and an asset to the England team, both on the pitch and off the pitch. And I'm delighted with the career that she's had and the contribution that she's made um, to the Lionesses and also the growth of the women's game. Um, she's been a fantastic servant. It's a little bit sad that um, she's not with us anymore in the future. Uh, but it's also a celebration with what she's done for the team and her whole career. And now that she becomes our number one fan, I would love to see her on the stands and uh, cheer us and uh, help us to uh, get some more wins in. She's an absolute legend um, and she's a phenomenal team player. No matter where you put, put her on the pitch, she gives 100% in everything she does. She works incredibly hard. She's very, very passionate about winning for England and playing for England. Um, and she's been a pleasure to work with for many, many years.